add or subtract the following expressions. Assume all variables are non-negative. A, 5 times the square root of 6 plus 4 times the square root of 6. These are called like radical terms, or simply like radicals. They are both, they both contain square roots of 6. So therefore they can be combined just as if we were combining like terms. So 5 times the square root of 6 plus 4 times the square root of 6 is 9 times the square root of 6. Exercise B, 7ab squared times the square root of 7ab plus 4a times the square root of 63ab to the fifth. These are not like radical terms, so we cannot combine them directly. But if I look at this radical, I can simplify it using the techniques we talked about uh, in a previous example. The square root of 63ab to the fifth, I can think of that as, well, that's 63, that's 9 times 7 times a. I'm looking for perfect square factors. b to the fifth is b to the fourth times b. So then the square root of 63ab to the fifth, that's the square, so doing a little bit of side work here, that's the square root of 9 b to the fourth times the square root of 7ab. Square root of 9b to the fourth, that's the square root of 9 times the square root of b to the fourth and the square root of 7ab. So that's 3b squared times the square root of 7ab. So I have 7ab squared times the square root of 7ab plus 4a times 3b squared times the square root of 7ab. 7ab squared, square root of 7ab, plus now 4a times 3b squared is 12ab squared times the square root of 7ab, and these are now like radical terms. So I can combine the coefficients, so I would have 7ab squared plus 12ab squared, and those are likes, so I'd have 19ab squared times the square root of 7ab. C, 8 times the square root of 3a plus 2 times the square root of 7a minus 3 times the square root of 3a plus 11 times the square root of 7a. I see some like radical terms. 8 times the square root of 3a minus 3 times the square root of 3a is 5 times the square root of 3a. Not 38. Sorry about that. 3a. 2 times the square root of 7a 11 times the square root of 7a, that's plus 13 times the square root of 7a. And that's all we can do with that. We would leave it alone.